them, and that's going to cause them to generally weaken here. So future max as we go into the evening, there's some of that rain trying to make it into the area around 8, 9, 930 or so. And as we continue into the night, future max may be overdoing the rain. There could be some showers out there Wednesday morning. And then as we get closer to lunchtime into the afternoon, we get some daytime heating in there and that's going to allow those storms to redevelop and some of the storms will produce some very heavy rainfall and also the potential for gusty winds as a front moves through late in the day. Once those storms get out of the area during the evening hours. We're going to be left with a drier and a cooler day coming up on Thursday. We are looking at a good amount of sunshine overall. Possible threats on Wednesday here. Winds maybe up to 60 miles per hour. Some small hail is possible. Not expecting any sort of tornadoes here. Your forecast as we get into tonight. Some of those isolated evening storms temperatures lower 70s and then as we look at your Wednesday here some storms try to develop around lunchtime and then into the afternoon temperatures hanging out around 90 degrees now if we get some better sunshine I think our high could be a little bit higher that's the part of the forecast that I'm still working on just a bit we're heating right back up as we go Friday and into the weekend, we've added some storm chances on Saturday, but I've taken some away on Sunday, so we may be facing a better chance for some of the storms on Saturday versus Sunday now as some of the models are speeding things up. And then early next week, initially not too bad, then we're right back in the middle 90s Tuesday.